the Lagos State Government is set to relocate the sawmillers millers of Okubaba in Ebutemeta, Lagos mainland to a permanent site in Abawa Ikosi in Ikosi Ejiri Local Council Development Area LCDA by the end of December 2022. Before we proceed to what has been done on the permanent site in Abawa, let's take a look at the current situation of Okubaba where the sawmillers currently do their business. As we can see from the video, the present state of Okobaba sawmill is not hygiene and not suitable place for human habitation. As a result of the state of environment of the current location in Okobaba, the Lagos State Government started the development of a new timber view during the Babatunde Fashola administration, but the project was stalled afterwards. This has created an atmosphere of uncertainty as the sawmillers in Okubaba lost hope in the project. But the current administration of Lagos State, led by Babajide Sonwolu, revisited the project by remobilizing the contractors back to site. On the 16th of August 2022, the governor went on a special tour of the facility. During his visit, the governor gave the assurance that the project will be delivered by December 2022. Also, the governor said more amenities were added to the timber view from the initial design for the comfort of the timber traders. Here we are at the location that is called the Timberville um, Sawmiller site here at Agboa uh, Ikusi. A jury um, under the Kosei JL um, This project was conceived quite a while back, like you've all um, observed. It's been on for, for a very long time. But we're happy that within our own government, we've activated it back. I will have spent a lot of money, resource, to be able to bring it to uh, a usable you know, and a convenient situation. So what you have here is first there must be an access route from the main road up until this side which is about three kilometers. One of the delays were like they have to do like a bridge crossing right and that 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 construction is almost completed. There are piles that have been um, that have been drilled and so we shouldn't be finishing that road construction very soon. But even in the alternative we've done an alternative road for them which is where you know we brought in here. And part of the facilities that are here is for the um, um, potential Okubaba summoners that are coming here. We've got a total of 160 two-bedroom flats that have been completed. We have offices that runs into tents, I and mean, you can see all of them. And they have all of their various sheets that have been also built. Um, one of the things that we need to do now is to do extensive cleanup. Right, the sheep piles around where um, they are going to be passing, everything has been done. Uh, what is remaining is for us to clear a trailer park for them, for us to clear what we call a boom area, and for us to be able to put a police post and do um, um, a fire 
uh, because you know because of, of dust and all of it a fire a small fire service here and the other thing that we also have in this facility that's built is a briquette facility which will be managed by loma which would mean that the byproducts coming out from the meal from the from the sawdust you know uh, will be treated here said the contractor is here and he has assured us that they can complete everything towards the end of the year so what it means is that in another two three months they indeed should be ready to start moving they should be ready because you know this is over 95 percent completed you know it's the shrubs the bush that we need to clear and clean up for them you know are the major major things that we need to do the road like i said the major road will be completed the bypass road has also been completed it's really to clean up you know the water I send up because it's supposed to be water you're supposed to be safe clean it up right and get a police post and a fire station which these are like six eight weeks job get it done and I mean I mean and just fix some of the roofs that are you know that have been blown up by by um, by the weather over the over the period and just get it cleaned up and they have like I said they are ready to go like like yesterday so once they can see physical improvement in the last in the next one month or two months we are, uh, we should be in a position to start seeing them, you know, to move. And the movement is not one day. It will probably take, you know, a week, a month, yeah, a month machines. and a half. There are machines and everything that has to be very in a very chronological order. They also need to allocate stores for their members. They need to allocate a proper um, accommodation for their members. Those are little, little logistics that needs to happen, right? So we're believing that before the end of the year, we should begin to see movements of some sort into this place you know before the end of the year that's all. now take a look at the area view of the timber view and how to access the location also we'll be taking a look at the amenities available at the timber view the timber view project has several facilities which include housing units, brickwork plants, operational area, offices, meeting area, restaurants, water system amongst others.